Carp anglers, pike anglers, fishermen alike, welcome to Chasing Chunks TV. If you've not seen this ugly mug before or this backdrop, then there's a good possibility that you're new to my channel. So it'd be greatly appreciated if you give it a subscribe. And at the end of this video, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. So today I'm going to be taking a closer look at this thing of beauty. This is the Daiwa 19 TDM. 3R12QD. QD standing for Daiwa's Quick Drag System. Now this is an upgrade from my previous reel, which was my Daiwa Ninja, which was also a 3000 size as well. However, on that review, which I'll leave at the end of this video, I did say that the only thing I didn't like about that reel was the responsiveness of the clutch so when i needed to upgrade i definitely wanted something with a quick drag i like to play my fish off the clutch and i like to like it to be responsive as well so after seeing this going into the tackle shop and trying them out then i opted to buy it and since then for the past 12 months i've used it on and off and I've caught some pretty good fish with it. The quick drag system goes from locked up to free spool in a quarter of a turn. And in between that, you've got notches so you can adjust how much line you want that fish to take during the fight. So I will leave a little bit on the footage for you and me bent into a very hard one car coming off and you can see how smooth it is so going on to the reel it's finished in a nice matte black finish the body is aluminium and it is really really light coming in at 10.8 ounce so that's really really light and obviously having the aluminium body contributes to the lightness you've got nice crown finishing and when you go around to the handle this is a one touch foldable handle so you got a little clip there and it just folds down for easy storage clicking it back you've got a nice foam EVA grip on there so if your hands are wet you're not going to slip off there and it does feel really comfortable in the hands as well You've got the air router, which is a lightened precision router. And if you can see, there's very, very little wobble there. And it is very, very smooth. Going up to the spool as well, aluminium, with a metal line clip, which is always welcomed because the last thing you want to do is have a plastic line clip on there because they will fail. So if you're match fishing or you're doing um, any sort of feeder fishing, you know, cart fishing, hitting the clip, it's always nice to have a robust metal line clip. You've got the air bale on there, which is light, thick and durable. And if you ever want to see the quality of a reel, always look at the bail arm. The thicker is usually the better quality of the reel. And it is also nice and responsive when clicking it over as well. Now for £120, obviously this is like the higher end of the reels out there. You do actually get a matching spare spool, which is exactly the same as what you got on the reel. And again, you've got a metal line clip on there. Some other companies put plastic ones in, but uh, not Daiwa. They've uh, kept with the aluminium spill. So that is the 19 TDM. You've got a 4.71 gear ratio. As said before, it's 10.8 ounces. Very, very light. Um, Maximum drag of 12 kg, very, very strong clutch. And you've got a 79 centimeter retrieval on there 
for every rotation. You've got four metal ball bearings. Again, that obviously aids with the smoothness of the reel. And again, one spare spool. Digi gears as well. And overall, if you're looking for a quality reel to go on your setup, this has gone on to my 12 foot uh, surface fishing rod, which is pretty light rod. It balances really, really well. And I'd say for 10 foot and nine foot rods, this is the perfect size. They do a bigger size, which is the uh, 4,000 size, and they also go down as well to I think the 1,000 size for the smaller rod applications, six foot and so forth. Again, I'll leave all the links to where you can get these from and all the information will be down below. If you have any questions, I'll always try and answer them and always try and uh, help you out. So just comment below and let me know your thoughts and what you think of these, if you got one as well or any questions. So it's definitely a thumbs up from me. Love this reel and it's definitely going to be in my armory for a very very long time definitely built to last so thank you for watching this short video hope you've, you like it hope you've taken something from this don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hopefully i'll see you on my next video so for me it's a beach bash bosh keep it tosh wet nets tight lines see you on my next video guys thank you for watching bye bye